Hi, welcome to People Get Ready Part 2. In this video we're going to talk about the lead guitar part. If you've come to the wrong video and you really wanted to do the uh, uh, rhythm track, then this link here will take you to the rhythm track tutorial. Uh, when you're finished, you can use this link here and that will take you to the finished song and you can play along. Okay, let's get started. It's quite easy. We've, we've just got three parts that we need to learn to this. There's a little motif that fits in between the verses. Uh, the song doesn't have choruses, so that's cool. So I'm going to teach you the motif first, then the verse backing, and then we'll do the solo as well. So let's get straight in with the little motif. Motif, let me play it for you first and then we'll go through it. Okay. So, for the first note of the motif, it's second string, tenth fret. Then, third string, ninth fret. 2nd string 10th, 1st string 12th, then we start that little bit again, so it's 2nd string 10, 3rd string 9, 2nd string 10, then 1st string 9, so so far we've got so the second part we're we're starting on the second string again, ten, third string nine, second ten. Then we're going to do a little slide. We're going to go from twelve to fourteen, and back to twelve, and then we're going to play the first and second strings. So we're doing a ten and a twelve, then a nine. And a ten, then a seven and a nine, then a two fives. So that was so let's put that all together. So we got the little motif sorted, now we're going to do the backing to the verse. So for this we generally palm, palm the strings um, so you'll get a kind of sound. So let's get straight into the verse. First note is the 4th fret 2nd string, 2nd note is the 5th string 4th fret. Then the fourth string, fourth fret, then fourth string, second fret. So that goes. Okay, so that's the first bar. Second bar. Start again on the same place. Fourth string, second fret, fifth string, fourth fret, then that's the um, fourth string open, then fifth string, fourth fret, fifth string, second fret, and just fifth string open. So that's so let's play that all together. It goes. So that's the first two bars of the, the verse. Um, the next, next bar is the same as the first one. So it's... And then it differs as the B flat minor comes in. We play the third string, first fret. Then... 4th string, 2nd fret, then 
fifth string, fourth fret. Then fourth string open again. Fifth string, fourth fret. Fifth string, second fret. Fifth string open. Let's try that with some backing. So we'll put the little motif in first. Right, finally, let's have a go at the uh, the solo. I'm not going to call out all the notes and strings for this. We'll, we'll I'll tell you where the awkward bits are, and I'm sure you can pick it up from the uh, the visuals. So, for the solo, we play the same little motif before the solo, and the solo just goes over the duration of the verse. So we're going to start with a bend, uh, and we are going to start on the the second string on the second fret, and it's. We're going to bend that. Okay, so we're going to take it up on a semitone. The second note is actually on the same, it's on the next string but on the same fret. So it's a, an interesting little maneuver you need. It's a, there we go. Okay, let's do that again. The, the first bar. Let's do that together. Okay, and then we start the same thing again, the same little bend. And then we do a little two string jobby. So we're going to go from those two there. So we're picking the second string and the third string. So we're going to go. is so we're starting on the second string again then we do the bend so we're going to bend this little fella here who's on the uh, the eighth fret and we're going to bend him up a whole tone at the same time as we play this guy on the fifth. So you're actually getting this note to be the same as that note. If you've got heavy strings, you might need to move your finger up to there so you don't have to bend him so far. But I've got light strings, so I'm going to play it there. Then we go. We're on to the second string again. A little... Drop down, down. Okay, so let's play all that together with the backing from the motif.
So that is the whole caboodle. You should have enough information now to play along with the, the full finished item. So as a reminder, you can get to the full finished uh, video to play with it up here. If you want your mate to learn the rhythm part, that's on this link over here. And then don't forget to subscribe so for more videos of finished items and some more tutorials. Love some feedback. Uh, want to know if it's too difficult, too much detail, not enough detail. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Cheers.